you bend your knees a little more, you get a little deeper stretch. And just hang there a minute. Check to make sure your arms are loose, just dangling there. Your head and your neck are loose. No tension anywhere. Straight through the spine. Bringing the head and chin up last. The wrist, the fingers are shaking loose. Then the other arm from the shoulder. And then the wrist, fingers, everything shaking loose. Okay. Uh, forward yawn stretch. Mm. Feeling that wide space between the shoulders. Oh. 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 Gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. Now just uh, structural and tonal energy leading each year. Right behind me. Each year. We come to... So target is a word I, I hear a lot of times you're not getting a good enough 5R on. Uh, and you use, that, you use that word quite a bit. Target. It, it needs more 5R. Target. And it's extraordinary, not extraordinary. Extra extraordinary. 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 Right. Extraordinary. Target. Extraordinary. Target. The convulsions in the Middle East and North Africa have laid bare deep divisions within societies as an old order is upended and people grapple with what comes next. Peaceful movements have been answered by violence for those resisting change and from extremists trying to hijack change. Sectarian conflict has re-emerged and the potential spread of weapons of mass destruction casts a shadow over the pursuit of peace. Go ahead. Just as significantly, just as significantly, the convulsions in the Middle East and North Africa have laid bare deep divisions within societies as an old order. One again, and this time put the emphasis on keeping a low baseline feeling all of the tonal anchors and making everything into tonal anchors. Just as significantly, the convulsions in the Middle East and North Africa have laid bare deep divisions within societies as an old order is upended and people grapple with what comes next. Peaceful movements have been answered by violence and from those resisting change and from extremists trying to hijack change. Sectarian conflict has re-emerged and the potential spread of weapons of mass destruction casts a shadow over the pursuit of peace. Work for keeping everything in a low bass tone. Stretch and breathe. Uh, uh, oh. breathe and stretch. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, your back oh. stretching out. Oh, take in some deep breaths. Oh, yeah, and that's a better preparation for getting right into keeping that low bass line because it'll come right to you out of that relaxation. Just as significantly, the convulsions in... Try, try it again. Just as significantly... Just as significantly... It's a, it's a better tone. It sounds nice. 
the intonation is hijack change, resisting change, hijack change, to make that contrast emphasis. Resisting change and hijack change. Right. Okay. Those Let's try doing this one now for speed. Let me do uh, do it once. Three, two, one, start. Just as significantly, the convulsions in the Middle East and North Africa have laid bare deep. The of mass destruction cast a shadow over the pursuit of peace. Thirty-one seconds. It's pretty good timing, yeah. really. Thirty-one. Sectarian conflict. Sectarian conflict. Okay, let's try and put it all together now. Working with a low bass line, keeping a nice, that nice good tone in there, and making the operative words stand out and uh, connecting things together quickly. Let me read a couple sentences in and then you come in behind me. Nowhere have we seen these trends converge more powerfully than in... Since have reached an agreement to place serious chemical weapons under international control and then to destroy them. So inclination has... Inclination. Yeah, that's I, neutral I, both of those, uh, I, in and clin. Inclination. Inclination. In, inclination, yeah. Both but incline. Yeah, not incline. Ah, incline, not inclined to. No inclination. Yeah. I have no I have no inclination to be inclined. <laughs> I have no inclination to be inclined. <laughs> no inclination to act at all. I <laughs> <laughs> did a very good job, you know, of linking in all the right natural little places to do it. Like, mm. like nor do I believe that in places like that that you just kept kept linking it in, into phrases. That's um, that's really very good timing, good linking. The way I feel about this speed training is like it's like it's like working muscles out. Do you feel that? Mm. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That, that's why I've been you know just doing it one paragraph after another you know, and not even getting into free speaking because I think this is such a good exercise. It's such a good exercise to build up your muscles, you know. Mm. Three, two, one. The United States of America is prepared to use all elements of our power, including military force, to secure these core interests in the region. We will confront external aggression against our allies and partners as we did in the Gulf War. We will ensure the free flow of energy from the region to the world. Although America is steadily reducing our... 61 seconds. 61 seconds is fast, actually. <laughs> Well, I did it in 51. I think you were a little slow. Mm. As a foundation for a broader piece. 25 seconds. Mm. Okay. Three, two, one. What does this mean going forward? In the near term, America's diplomatic effort will focus on two particular issues. Iran's pursuit of nuclear weapons and the Arab-Israeli conflict. While these issues are not the cause of all the region's problems, they have been a major source of instability for far too long, and resolving them can help serve as a foundation for a broader peace. 27.9. Wow. I did it in 25, you did it in 28. <laughs>